Hey, welcome back to No Man's Sky with the spear. Something is chasing me, and I don't know what it is. But something is out there. These animals are going crazy. Look at all these animals. Tell me that's not a lot. That's crazy. Look at that! Th th what? That's crazy. Ah, water. What? What is that in the water? I guess that's some kind of fish. That is 12 of 12. Whatever those worms are. That... <laughs> We've completed 12 of 12. Let's get out of here. Oh my... I cannot believe all these animals we've come across. This is the local watering hole for sure. There were hundreds right there. Yeah, and something is... Around, there it is. All right. Let's stay away from that. I was heading out towards this question mark, which looks like an observatory. Yeah. No, it, it might be a colonial outpost where I have to break down the door that might be it unfortunately my suit is full I have had so many uh, I've come across so many goods in this long trek and trust me it is a long trek I am at least 10 minutes away can I get oh look at all that plutonium look at all that plutonium I cannot give up that plutonium Although, I don't know why I'm getting it. I've got so much plutonium back in storage. But, I mean, come on. I'll be kicking myself later when I try to take off and don't have any plutonium. Oh, wow. Alright, so we are going to free up one slot... Because I've used my very last shield. I could make more shields, but if I made another shield, it'd take up my final slot. And I think I'm going to need my slot for a bypass chip to call my ship. Because I've got a lot of stuff. There's another. Whoops! There you go. I've mowed down a lot of those. I am surprised there are still more. Most of them have been potential threats, possibly coming at me. Some of them, I admit, have not been. Yep, got a vine. Strangely, in this whole trek, that's my first vine that I've run into. The Jure Crater. Undiscovered. There's our bypass chip use ship thing, if you know what I'm saying. You probably don't know what I'm saying, because I said just a bunch of random words. No, as a matter of fact, before I do anything else, I'm calling the ship. So that no matter what happens, I will be able to get out of here without walking back. How far was it? I, I don't even... I turned to look at the time, and I don't think I ever did. Uh, oh, only seven and then seven minutes, 45 seconds. That's. I thought it was a lot longer than that. Look at that little one! Even baby uh, crab octopuses uh, attack. That's weird. Alright, come on, stop doing this. I am so greedy. I do not need Chrysonite. I have too much Chrysonite back at the base. I do kind of need Platinum because... I'm a little concerned because we use up so many shields. Wow. Alright. I still have an empty slot. The ship is here finally. Let's quickly save. So this has been a heck of a... a heck of a trip. I mean, I hit a couple more storms on the wet, long walk over here. Got a lot of material. Picked up a lot of goodies. 
But I would have sworn I was going to get too much stuff. And frankly, I kind of did. Hello, Divine Atlas. Fascinating. He wants life form data. Hmm. That's what I think he wants. He says life form data, yes. 1700 units, that's useless. <laughs> Hopefully they will, uh, will they ever change that? Nah, they'll never change that. They would have changed it by now. Seventeen hundred units when you have seven million isn't a, look at that thing, that's the Ew. So that was our last species there, that some kind of worm. That is not attractive. Three hundred thousand units. And the eighth planet we've discovered all species. Where's my milestone? Give it up. There it is. Journey milestone accomplished. Classifier. Discovered all species on eight planets. Polo wants me to do ten. And I must listen to Polo because Polo gives me warp engines, I believe. And what I definitely want are better warp engines. I need warp engines to finish uh, all the jobs I've been given at my base. Can I free up another slot? Probably not. Although I could drop all this carbon. I could use another shard. Nope, not enough. Shard. going to be able to... So I can either drop 42 iron or drop 97 carbon. Or remove some of these signal things. Which would probably be best. Or just not do either because I don't think I will need to. I will pick up a shield. I will use that shield. I will pick up this. Another get char. Can I go to six crosses? I've got five crosses. I don't know if I can go to six. I don't think I can. Oh, I can go to six. Nice. So I'm at full health now. I think I added on a little tech. Uh, yeah, health module plus one sigma there. Oh, let's get inside. I guess that's it. That is really it for this planet. We've done everything we can do. We've uploaded the last waypoint. 7.3 million units. Really what we need to do is sell some things. There's one other planet and two moons in this system. So I could either go to the space station and sell everything, or I could stay here and look for a place to sell everything. I will make one quick pass. Well, that was fast. What is this? What is this thing? It looks like another observatory. Why wow, you would have two observatories so close together. But anyway, that's... You know, sometimes you... I was looking for a long time for that final species, and I was lucky it just popped up when it did. But you never know. I mean, that worm that was only in that one spot. I, I passed so many different watering holes just looking around, trying to find water. And there it was. But that's what I said. You, it'll be three fish species and that lived in the water. 
it's, it's either one or three. And the other one was a bird. I predicted a bird and a fish. And we got a bird and a fish. Oh yeah. Look at that. Whoa! What's that guy doing inside? That was sneaky. Very sneaky. The plasma clip theta. Clip size plus 75%. Didn't have to reload at all. Okay, I don't know if it's going to let me do anything since I'm full. Alright, let's reload. Corvax Operations Center. I rapidly flick through alien warnings to discover the uh, discover what's brought the facility offline. All too late, I'm doing the exact same thing again and again. I've done this before many times, so I'm in some kind of time loop. Oh, you know, I already know it's time. So the Corvax words are not helping me at all. So I'm doing this again and again. I realize I'm doing the exact same thing again and again and again and again and again and again and again. Resetting the clock that probably wouldn't help. Recharging doesn't help. I think this might work. Engage temporal capacitor, which either sends me into a new time loop or fixes everything. Ta da! Terriumin. I can now make Terriumin. Emerald, gold, and Herox. I doubt I'll ever make any Terriumin. But thank you for that. I used to, back in the good old days when Emerald and Gold were. Well, more available, easier to get. Alright, we're still looking for some place to sell our goodies. Got a lot of stuff on this planet. I don't know what's chasing me, but I'm not sticking around to find out. Let's go, go, go! This has been a pretty good system. I don't know why I'm saying it, but I think it is. Yeah, two planets, two uh, completions. I think that one planet that I ran away from was in the other system. It was a one planet system. Get some nanites. take off and head for the whoa about to take off and head for there you go galactic trade terminal engage nice 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 it's only 52 degrees now it's rather nice I'm gonna see how many times I can say nice Let's see, sell. I'm selling this Mordite. No point in keeping it. No point in keeping that. Emerald gone. Oh, I want to keep those Vortex Cubes. I think I need them. I think I'm going to need Vortex Cube for some kind of technology. I would almost bet on it. There's some technology. I don't know what it is. Is it the ship or the... Something needs uh, vortex cubes. I'm certain of it. I actually think I need about five of them. But that'll be a while, won't it? Alright, 
time to get off this rock. Look at that thing. Look at that worm. That's that's not attractive. Jeez. That was fun. Getting that to be my last thing. Let's sell that fascination bead and take off. Almost seven and a half million units. Nice. I think seven million units is about the cost of a freighter. I'm not sure what I'd do with a freighter, but I think I can now afford one. I could probably upgrade my ship substantially at the uh... I'm thinking next time I get to the uh, space station I might uh, I might go to the space station right now I think there's one planet and two moons see any moons here, but I'm so close they might be near by. Is that a moon? That looks like a moon down there. Alright, so what we got, yeah. So that one planet is hiding behind the other planet. There's one moon over there. There's probably a second moon. Okay, so we know exactly where to go. see the second moon. It's behind the two red signs. Whoa, 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 whoa. You see it up there at the very top between the two planets. Uh-oh. Um, let's get rid of that. Mr. Pirate, who do you think you are? <laughs> there it is. My trophium. Whoops. Don't want to do that. That may have been the wrong button. Alright, now where am I going? This one? Yeah, this one, with the two moons. Ramo Tapaja. Twenty-eight percent. Seventy-eight percent. Sixty-eight. Let's make a shark. And another sheet. I should probably just get on going. We gotta get moving. We can't stay out here for another. If I keep staying here, I'm gonna get another pirate on me. This is not working. It's not working. All right. If it doesn't want to work, I can't make it work. I will send that over there. And now try it. Hey, it works now. Esters. Double A. Undiscovered moon. Oh, we can get to level 10 on the animals. Species discover. We're at 8, and we have two moons and a planet. And got here just in time. Here, toxicity. If you can hear rain, uh, 
toxic rain against your ship. That makes toxicity. And I hear it, but this is a this is kind of a brownish world. Toxic worlds are mostly green. That's weird. So I don't know what to think. Alkaline rain. What? Well, I don't have any shielding at all in there, do I? Nope. So I'm back to another world where I need uh, protection. We've wait a second. This is the uh, yeah. We've hit toxic and heat and toxic again. Thought I saw these guys over here. Hello, Mr. Animal. How you doing? Don't run away, baby dinosaur. Now tell me that ain't a baby dinosaur. That's so cute. Uh-oh. Stay away from that crab. Dude, get out of the way. There's platinum over there, but... Hey, both of those guys are nice. What are the odds of that? Look at these dinosaurs. They're so small. That guy could be trouble. Nope. Friendly crabs, you don't see that very often. I've discovered you. I think I just looked at his daddy. I came all over here for one platinum. Uh oh. Yeah, that guy's a hunter. Okay, so. Age perpetual. That's not bad. You can't ask for much more than perpetual, I tell you that. Alright, we got most of the guys around here. That was pretty nice. Quickly get a bunch of them. Never many birds on these kinds of worlds. <laughs> I'll give this triangle head. I don't know what that thing is doing. The triangle heads are always nice, it seems like. I don't remember ever having a uh, predator triangle. Look, <laughs> he's on two legs now. What? Why is that thing on two? I I must admit, I don't remember ever seeing a two-headed triangle, or two-legged triangle guy. That was interesting. Wow. So we're kind of going through the uh, shields. Look at that. Look at that. Hello! You're like a person! What? That's, that, that is so crazy. That is what humans evolved out of. Before we were humans, we were uh, triangle heads like that. Ha! That is awesome. They need more two legged animals. I love it. Something big way over there. I may have already discovered that guy's kids over here. Oh, nope. New species.
All right, let's get to the base real quick. So we have a building to uh, get out of. Boy, this, yeah, this rain is pretty tough. The acidic rain. So let's go to the base. Where is it? To the left there, I think. Oh. All right. That's the way they're going to be. Oh, wow. I have been making a lot of shields recently. I need some iron. I'm stuck on the post. Ah! That was great. One of my w one of my wings got stuck on the post. That was funny. Whoop! Gotta make a detour. Let's quickly make some protection. Oh, I got protection. Can't pass up one of these. Corvax for Electron. White. When am I going to learn all the words? And loss. Hey, nice. Flying fish. Eight out of ten. Eight out of ten already. Wow. Topak Reed. Onamach Atlas. Looking down, I notice an ancient coin. I unearth several more coins. Offer units. They thank and bless me. Had this been the uh, Viking, I may have taken the coins. But nice people like the Corvax, no. Learned a couple Atlas words. Got a few things. Health at maximum, which it already was. Let's go. Look at that thing, a triangle. Or that pyramid triangle. Wrong with me. All right. At some point, we do need to stop by the base. I was tempted to stop by the base before we came here, but it was only going to be to put away two vortex cubes, so I figured we could wait. So we're going to land at this base. This base will give us a good, a good spot to. Uh, walk out and try to find the other two species. I'm not sure what they could be. I'm not going to go out on a limb and predict anything this time. I'm pretty sure, I'm going to guarantee they're not fish. But other than that, your guess is as good as mine. But that'll be next time. So we'll call it here. We just landed at this Fuglug Swamp Fuglad Swamp. We'll pick it up here next time with more No Man's Sky with the spear. Oof. Look at those cool things. We're on this moon. After this moon, we'll go over to the other moon and that planet? Yes. Those are the last two we need to discover. Alright. Thanks for watching. See you next time.